is my review for this week's Naruto Manga Chapter 630, so let's get into this. So this week's Naruto Manga Chapter overall was a decent chapter. Like, the thing is, I actually like this chapter. This chapter was good. I like how it ended. I like the QB just, just still, he's still going all out. I mean, there's a lot of things to like about this chapter, but the reason why I'm giving this a decent is the fact that how this chapter was structured. Like, I mean, I like the structure of how they had it where um, Kakashi was saying this, like, little this little uh, speech, and then it was going back to, like, the fight, and then going back. Like, I like how it was going back and forth a little bit. It was, it was nice little pacing that they had with it as well. But at the same time, I felt like they could have added a lot more to this chapter, because overall, half this half this um, manga today was just a bunch of Kakashi speech. And, you know what I mean? So it's just I feel like they could have added a lot more content if they condensed Kakashi speech a little bit. You know what I mean? They could have added a lot more stuff to it. I, I really felt that they could have added more to this chapter, which is why I'm just going to have to give it a decent, you know, so, but overall, but I liked it, though, I liked it, though, so, the first thing I really want to address is Kakashi is under an illusion, but it's not the illusion, like, like I was thinking, where, that's, Obito's whole totally based on an illusion, and it's not, it's not, I think, that, we, what we see Obito right now is actually him, and you guys may be right on this, because I got some comments basically saying that his body was made up of an entirely, like, Zets, like, his entire body, I think, his body, not his head, I think his head actually still be, like, alive, in a sense, because otherwise, there's no way of killing him. If he, if his body is entirely just Zetsu, there's no way of killing him. So I'm thinking that his head is like his anchor that keeps him alive, which is why he has retained memories and all sorts of stuff. Or something. I mean, I don't know. I feel like his head could be the, like, the, 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 the killing point, basically, to cut off his head or something. Like Highlanders, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's the only way to kill him. So I don't know. I, I'm thinking maybe his head is still alive, and that's maybe the way to finally, like, finish off Obito. But, yeah, Kashi, he does his whole entire speech and everything like that. And, you know, with, with, with that illusion, by the way, we saw, like, Little Ren and, and, and uh, Little um, Obito. He's like, say, I won't be Okage, but Kakashi's like, we don't love this freaking fake crap. You gotta face reality, son. Face reality. And he's like, I wanna face reality. <laughs> I wanna make my own reality. And, um, yeah, Kakashi ends up using Obito's little saying on, on Obito. It, it, it was funny, you know? <laughs> People that betrayed their friends is worse than trash crap. I was like, oh, is he using it on you, son? Don't you get it? Don't you get it? You oh, he made a saying that backfired on you, son. I was like, okay. <laughs> I don't know. I, I found that kind of funny. That's why. That's the only reason why I kind of like the speech a little bit, because because he kind of like added that in there. I was like, okay. Okay. Uh, okay. You know, I, I, I don't know. I, I personally don't like that. And so, uh, other things I need to talk about is, yeah, Sakura, he, he ends up kind of like doing a little speech. Like, this is funny. This is dude. That was there. <laughs> he kind of admits to himself that he is like fodder. Like, I'm glad Naruto's been protecting us. I'm like, Sakura, you, you, you were nice. Just Sakura, do it. Do, do work. Like, that's what Naruto, that's what basically Sakura was saying. Do work. You know, it's how to, it's how to do work. Stop relying on Naruto and do work. <laughs> it was just, it was funny. But, I mean, her speech is okay. It was okay. I mean, I, I don't know. It's just like, I guess it's somewhat needed for some of these other people. But, I mean, I don't know. I don't know. She, I guess she, she had to get her time to shine. It was kind of weird that we actually get to see B in this chapter because since Naruto's out, it's time for time for B to start trying to do something, though he kind of didn't really do anything in this chapter, he tried to, like, push himself, he, like, he tried to block the Biju bomb that the Juby was doing, because Juby, he made in a massive Biju bomb, I don't know what the heck that thing was, like, he, like, kind of, I don't know, he, like, I guess he, like, transformed or something, like, it was weird what he did in this chapter, like, he turned, kind of, like, looked like a flower, like, he opened his mouth really, 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 really big, something came out of him, there's, like, a flower thing, and it just turned, it's, like, the Biju bomb that came out of it, I'm like, what the heck is going on, but apparently he's going to his metamorphosis stages, and that, I think if they can't stop this, then that's when the Juby is going to end up transforming. You know, that's what that's what that's what they're saying. So he's going to go to his final form. So I look forward to this. See the perfect form. Mm. But uh, yeah. So the thing is, the Juby actually noticed that Naruto is becoming the Six Six Pass after the last panel. You know how the all the um other um, Jubies and stuff, all the uh, Jinchurikis and all that crap, they're like behind Naruto and everything. Yeah. So I think he noticed that for some reason. And I think. He's mad, he's, like, mad about that. Because Juby's, like, getting more and more, like, like, like well, he's already been, be, been kind of crazy, but he's getting more crazy. He's getting more crazy, so he's, like, I think he's mad about that. It's interesting, because the, the Juby doesn't want to be sealed up, because the fact that Naruto's becoming this, he knows that Naruto's going to end up sealing him and stuff, and that's what's probably bothering him at this point. But the one, the, but the really interesting thing is, Madara noticed that as well. How do you see, I was, I was saying, like, it was visible? That's all, I, I, I was assuming that was like some sort of symbolism, symbolism, but it was visible or or what? Maybe it's because Madara can see it because of the like the Renegon and all that stuff. Maybe that's part of the reason why he can see it. I don't know. It, it's it's interesting though. 
it's interesting that they even notice that stuff. So it, it's it's interesting. Like I said, Naruto is gonna become the sixth path. He's gonna absorb that Juvi. The Juvi knows this, and that's why Juvi's like, I gotta wipe you out, son. I gotta kill people. <laughs> I gotta freaking do some stuff. I gotta show some feats. Uh, so um yeah, and then and also in the chapter, Shikamaru ends up coming with his plan, and basically his plan. Now here's the thing. Now I want to say this too. This is not a plot hole. I just want to say this right now. What Shikamaru is trying to do is get everybody to do a earth style jutsu. Now, this is not necessarily a problem because I don't think he means I mean, he says literally everybody, but I think he I don't know. I don't think he means literally everybody because the thing is the thing. Like if if because the thing is we don't see everybody do it. What we who who we see doing this jutsu is Shikamaru, Choji, and Eno doing a like weak earth style walls. That's all that's all they're doing, just trying to slow down the VG box. The VG coming and so they're trying to block it with walls. That was Shikamaru's plan. And the thing is I can, like, it makes sense. It makes sense how how this works. Because here's the thing. Shikamaru, Choji, and Eno did it. For what we know, we don't know their um, elements. Because the thing is, this would have been a plot hole if Naruto were to say that, like, do a, like a, like a wood, not wood, but uh, Earth-style Jutsu. Or that Earth-style Jutsu, for instance. You know, that would have been a plot hole because we know he has Wind-style Jutsus. He doesn't have Earth-style. And you, you can only do Earth-style Jutsus if you have that element. You know what I mean? So the thing is, we don't know what Inoshiko or Ch um, Chogi, um, Shikamaru or Chogi, we don't know if if they have Earth style. Oh, well, I'm pretty sure Chogi does, because I mean, anyone that's physical like that usually have Earth style. But we don't know Ino and Shikamaru because they use their, I think Genkai Hikai, you know, the their family trait to use their moves and stuff, shadow clones and mind manipulation. So yeah, that's not a plot hole. But it could have been if we saw like someone else do. Even Sakura did it would have been it would have been okay because we don't know hers either. You know what I mean? But if it, like I said, if it was like, I said, oh, who, who else? Uh, I don't know. If it would have been anyone else, <laughs> you know what I mean? Anyone that actually had an actual element, like Sasuke or something, that would have been a plot hole. You know what I mean? But that's not a plot hole. I just want to just throw that out there. But it, it was interesting. I was like, what do you mean by everybody? I mean, come on now. You can't do that. But, uh, yeah, so I think in this chapter, Minato ends up coming. He ends up taking that, he, he ends up getting his little kunai, throws a kunai within the VG bomb and make that crap. It's a big, Like that. I was like, yeah, we, we, oh, Ricky Minato! Minato is here, man. I was like, yes, yes. And that means other Kage is right here. That means we're going to see Madara's reaction to Hashirama. And Hashirama is going to see Brig Madara. And they're going to be like, my brother. So I'm going to be happy to see this, man. I can't wait to see the next chapter. I just know in the next chapter, we're probably going to see all the Kage's there. We're going to probably see Madara's reaction to how he feels about this. I'm pretty sure it's like, time to get the boss started. You know, I can't wait to see it. And I'm pretty sure that Juvie may, at the end of the at the end of the next chapter, may go into the final metamorphosis to finally go into his ultimate mode to start beating some people up. So I'm like I'm looking forward to the next chapter. This is a, this is a, this was a, like I said this was a decent chapter. I, I liked it though, but it's a decent chapter nonetheless. So leave comments below to what you think of this week's Naruto Monk chapter. Like you like this review and subscribe to my channel if you want to see some more Naruto reviews from me. So yeah, it's been the Breakmaster, and until then, break out.